Hi, I'm uh, Chris Arkless, the Planetarium Officer here at uh, Launceston Planetarium at the Queen Victoria Museum and Art Gallery. Today we're having a bit of a different look at our Zeiss projector and it needs a fair bit of maintenance to uh, keep it uh, functioning properly. It's full of uh, slip rings and contacts and uh, gets uh, dust and dirt and so we have to clean it and lubricate it uh, when we get a chance. And I've decided that now is a good time to give it a fairly major overhaul. So we're pulling it apart a bit today and shortly we're going to remove the uh, northern starfield uh, ball which is that sphere at the top of the machine. It's lucky my uh, working background has led me to be able to look after a machine like this. Uh, yeah, I've actually been here on site at Inveresk for far too long now. I uh, started here as uh, an apprentice electrician with uh, the signals and communications section of the railways when this was the railway workshop. And a lot of the technology that I used to work with is quite similar to the technology we find in this machine. It's uh, yeah, a, a true electromechanical device. As you can see in the lower part of the column here, we've got uh, quite a few cards, which uh, the one that I'm particularly working on at the moment, this first one, which is the North and South Star Field, where we've got the white and blue room illumination, compass lights, Mercury and the Sun, Moon and Venus, and so on. A lot of it is basically clockwork. The, these tubes here, they are the Sun, the Moon and the planets. The entire thing is driven by just two motors in that section. There are three main motors all together. So we just tell that motor to run and tell it how fast to run and that's the rest of it is done by the mechanical uh, structure of the machine. Now there's nothing much to see here at the moment because I've got it powered down while we're pulling it apart, but this, uh, this keyboard here is the main interface between me or the operator and the machine. So we've got uh, some potentiometers there for controlling uh, daily motion, annual motion, polar motion and processional motion, that's another motor that's in it, and a series of buttons which luckily do illuminate very slightly for when we're running a show. Uh, so through this keyboard and the screen, we can uh, we direct the machine to what to do. There's another cabinet of uh, equipment down here with a PC and a whole lot of other uh, cards down there, which is probably a bit dark for the camera. But uh... so it's a it's a complex gadget.